Oh. Good Diane. I need to get one of these. Yeah, it's easy, so. Yeah, they're, they're pretty good. I got a tripod. You ready, Diana? We're gonna do it. We're gonna do a little video for Kim because she's running for Secretary of State. You can pick whoever you want. You gonna be there on the 11th? Well, I'm not a central delegate. So Mary had a rock star event today. This, if people want to come and see what's going on, you gotta show up for the Liberty Tea Party. Oh, yeah. Patriots move uh, once a month. Yeah, Mary's amazing. She really put on a good show. Absolutely. And we got you know lots of really great stuff here. You ready to go, Diana? Yeah, my orientation wants to be this way. I'm so gravity We're good. problems. We're good. So anyway, so am I talking to you or am I talking to you? To both of us. I'm okay, to both or, or, or okay. whatever. Yeah. Okay. So how? So you want to just introduce yourself? All right. I'm Kim Crockett. I'm an attorney here in Minnesota. You guys know me through my work. Center of the American Experiment and advisor to Minnesota Voters Alliance. Um, I got called to the election integrity space well over a year ago. It's been about a year and a half, right? My spidey sense went off early in 2020, and I looked at our election laws and what was going on in the country. And so I've been focusing my my efforts on. Uh, Figuring out uh, how it works and how it doesn't work uh, nationally, but also here in Minnesota. And uh, long and short of it is, I've decided to run for Secretary of State. Uh, it's exciting. Uh, it's a little intimidating, too, uh, to all of a sudden throw my hat in the ring. But this has actually been something I've been thinking about for a very long time. Uh, Minnesota has very sloppy election laws. And they're not worthy of us, frankly, uh, as citizens, whether we're Democrats, Republicans, Independents. And so I want to uh, spend some time on the campaign trail teaching people about our election laws, uh, where we can improve things. And the goal, frankly, is just to raise everybody's confidence in the outcome of elections after I've been Secretary of State uh, and working with the legislature. Uh, for a term or two. I'll need a little bit of time to pull that off. We want you to win, too. Yeah, well, I gotta Absolutely. win first. So when's your next event? Well, it'll probably be in the new year. Right now, what I need to do is talk to delegates uh, at the Republican Party on December 11th and ask them to support me in the straw vote that day uh, for Secretary of State. Uh, and then, frankly, let people celebrate the Christmas season. Uh, this is a time of year we should be focused on Advent. Uh, and, and Christmas, and then we'll go at it hard uh, in the new year. But because of the state central meeting, I wanted to get in front of the delegates and let them know that I was willing to serve. Uh, hopefully that will be welcomed uh, enthusiastically. Uh, and then we're off and running. Uh, we start voting in September of 2022. Because if you'll recall, we have a 46 day voting season. Why? And how does that serve election integrity? How does that bolster our confidence in election results? Uh, so, those are the kinds of things I'll be talking about uh, in the new year. And I'll keep you posted on, on events and uh, opportunities to talk about elections. All right. I appreciate your interest. Well, thank you. You are thank welcome. You. <laughs> thank you. Thanks for speaking. You are welcome. Good to see you. You too.